welcome. In front of me is a Realme GT Neo 3 and today I'll show you how we can hard reset this phone through recovery mode. Now this process will also remove things like screen lock, so if you, if you have one that you don't know, this will allow you to get rid of it. Now I do have one set, so I'm gonna lock the device just so you can see it right here, and I'll progress from the lock screen as though I don't know it. So number one, we will need to turn off our device by holding the power key. Be nice if we can see our display, there we go. Okay, so power key doesn't bring up the power menu, so I'm gonna try something else. Power key and volume down. Now this should forcibly turn off our phone. Apparently that doesn't do it either. Power key and volume up bring up brings up the boot menu. Hopefully it won't request. Okay, and then it request the key or the key combination to actually turn it off like Samsung does. So anyway, power key and volume up will uh, bring up the boot menu apparently. So from here, once you have turned it off, you want to hold power key and volume down. Now when you see the Realme logo, you can let go of the power key, keep holding volume down. And as you can see, this brings us a language selection. Now, the selected one at the top has a little bit brighter, but we do have English right here. I know it's barely visible, but there we go. Once you select it, as you can see, it goes into English. From here, you want to select wipe data. So again, just press on it and then select format data, which is the only option right here. It tells us that we need to enter this code right here. So 8990, that is the one that I have right now generated. Though if I would leave this, it's gonna regenerate the code once more. So it is randomly generated. Okay, uh, so just input it right here. Select format, which is uh, in this red text that I basically cannot see on the camera. Hopefully you can see it. It's literally right here. Once you press on it, it will begin formatting, which only takes a couple seconds right here. Gives you an info, data formatted. Okay, so click on that, and this will now initiate a reboot of the device. So to finish this off, it will take like a couple minutes. So just be patient. Once it's finished, you should be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your phone however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.